Hi guys, and welcome back to another episode of VChat Creates. And today, I'll be creating some art out of a milk carton. Yes, guys, a milk carton. So you guys are probably wondering, what is a milk carton going to be used for in this project? And I got a few ideas. So let's go to the sketch, and I'll show you guys what I'm thinking. So I was thinking about making a cutout in the middle of it, so that I can make my thing inside, which is going to be a scenery with the house. Right? And then I felt like I was going to cut it from a three-quarter pose to make the full amount shown throughout the entire um, just milk carton. So then it could be more to be seen. And then I would move on to the houses. So I was thinking maybe doing more like a hut kind of thing. Um, but then I realized that maybe more structured would be better. And yeah. I felt like I should combine these two ideas to make the best result possible. And then I'll have some foliage around the house, so then it could look, it should just tie it in all together. And finally, I thought of just making some characters to make it look like livable. So yeah, uh, now with all that said guys, let's get started. Like I said before guys, I'd like to first start off by cutting open the carton of milk. So once I finished cutting, I would remove the top from the carton and then I would get started with the inside of the milk carton. Okay, so um, now I will get started with the frame of the house. So I have to do a little bit of quick maths and just try to get the proportions right. So I, you know, the ruler was 12 inches, I just divided it by four pieces, which is three inches each, quick maths. So yeah, I use these um, these measurements to make the sides of the house. Okay guys, so then I soon realized that I had to mix the two items together. So remember the sketches I did? I said there was one slanted one that looked more like a hut and the other one was more structured. Where I thought of maybe getting a ruler and trying to make some straight lines to make it like kind of angled so then I could lie the other boards on it so then it can make it the house look a little bit more in the mix between the structured and the non-structured. And then once I got all the boards together, I start to tape them together with a, a brown colored tape so then it won't be too obvious when I start painting it, painting it over it. And yeah, I felt like the brown tape held pretty good together and that's why I continued throughout the entire project. Okay guys, so now it's time to paint the sky. Uh, I decided to go with a light blue color for the base of the background, and then I would touch it up with a different shades of blue to give it an extra sense of coolness. Next guys, I would paint the base of the structure with a brown color so then I could add extra light touches on top of it later when it dries.
next guys I would move on to the characters so I decided to make these characters um, different colors that would be just make it look cool together so they would be either red yellow orange and purple and yeah it was, I made these characters out of clay by the way so it was pretty easy coloring them Guys, and I would also paint the base of the milk carton a green, so when I put the foliage inside, it won't look empty and there won't be a lot of gaps inside the inside the milk carton. Next guys, I would endeavor into the front yard of my house and try to pick up some plants. But I soon realized some of them had some thorn thorns on them and it kind of hurt my fingers. But yeah, so I got plants that would make the entire scene tie together and just make it look nice. So yeah. Okay guys, so I just finished a project and now it's time for TTRTP. So if you guys don't know what TTRTP is, it's basically an acronym I made for time to review the project and that is what I want to be doing right now. Okay guys, so at first before I started this, I was a little hesitant on starting this project because I didn't really know what to make out of just a milk carton. But then as I continued just to like brainstorm, I thought like it would be kind of like a ship in a glass bottle kind of thing. But yeah, so it just made it look nice with the different types of materials I use, the contrast between the actual like real life plants to the cardboard and just the painting inside kind of tied it in all together. And um, these clay characters turned out really good as well. And something I discovered also is that air dry clay works best, that the color turns out the best before it dries. So you have to paint it before the clay dries. So you know, that's cool to figure out something out. And yeah, I felt like the plants also really tied it in together, making more like that jungle theme. And the top of it, the top of the milk card, I took the cap off and I added a big plant to make it look like it's coming out of the top. So overall, this project was really fun and I'm really happy with the outcome guys and with all that said um if you really like this video guys please share with everybody you know and just hit the like button guys hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you guys won't miss out on any new content so see you guys next time and keep creating